The computer needs help in using the telephone. This is because computers and telephones don't talk the same language. The computer speaks binary code, ones and zeros, whereas the telephone speaks in a series of tones. So you need to put a special black box between the computer and the telephone to transform or modulate computer talk into telephone talk. Then whatever you type in at your computer can go out over the phone lines and be understood by any other telephone. But before that telephone can send your message along to a second computer, another sort of black box is needed to transform or demodulate telephone talk back into computer talk. So once computer A has a modulator and computer B has a demodulator, A can send messages to B. But this is only one-way communication. B still can't send messages to A. To make it two-way communication, computer B needs a second black box to modulate its owner's message to you from computer talk to telephone talk. And computer A needs a second black box to demodulate that message from telephone talk back into computer talk. But to save having to buy two black boxes for each computer, a modulator and a demodulator, they can be combined into one box, a modulator-demodulator, or a modem. Once a computer is equipped with a modem, it can both send and receive messages to and from any other computer in the world that is also equipped with a similar sort of modem. <laughs>